I'm vlogging, it's Vlogmas, it's a lot of fun, I'm vlogging, it's Vlogmas, let's see what I got done, Merry Christmas! Good morning vlog, today we're gonna try this coffee. I just looked at my phone. I guess I hadn't looked at it much this morning. <laughs> I hadn't, I've been doing things, but um, we're having a two hour late start because of icy roads. Doesn't mean really anything for me. I still have to get to work at the same time. So my safety doesn't matter, <laughs> but student safety and parents safety, very important. Um, so my principal was like, you still have to show up on time. Just drive safely. Okay, thanks. I'll do my best. The sunrise looks really pretty today. I should show you it. That's pretty, right? Anyways, it's kind of nice because that means I only have... Well, because today I have my hardest first graders. So that means, since it's a two-hour late start... <coughs> that was a gross-sounding burp. Since it's a two-hour late start, that means I only see the kids for half an hour today, which kind of sucks for some of them. Um, it just shortens things for every everything, but um, since I have those hard first graders, it means I go from seeing them for 45 minutes to only 30 minutes, which is fantastic because 45 minutes is honestly too long. When I see them half an hour, I think like I don't feel as bad. Like it's like okay, that sucked, but at least it was only half an hour. But 45 minutes, oh my gosh, it starts dragging on, man. So I'm glad that I'm kind of glad about this. And then tomorrow is a late a late start too, so we're gonna have two late starts in a row. Okay, we're recording for choir tomorrow. We're pro rehearsing today with both choir B and A because I have two fifth grade choirs. I have two fifth grade classes in one choir and two fifth grade classes in the other choir. So I see two of them. I see one choir on two days and one choir on the other two days. So today I'm seeing both choirs and tomorrow I'm seeing both choirs because we're practicing and rehearsing for recording for our, our like concert for winter. Um, so today I'm seeing both of them. So we'll have a little less time to rehearse, which isn't ideal, but uh, it's fine. I'll see him tomorrow when we record. Hopefully it goes well. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. If it's a late start, that means I see choir first thing first in the morning. Okay. I'm just thinking out loud now. Anyways, it is time for me to stop talking and finish drinking this coffee because I probably only have like two minutes until I'm supposed to leave here. Or less, honestly. Hello, I'm wearing my hat. It's gonna, it's gonna keep me warm today. Also, my hair looks kind of ridiculous with it on, the way it's flinging off the sides, but whatever. <laughs> big donut <laughs> they're just they have donuts in the staff room this morning so I got a donut also I'm a little hot can you tell I'm glistening right now my up oh, well that's a chapstick I'm like shiny um I've been walking around getting papers and stuff for the party and whatnot and I was asking like do we give our secret Santa gift to the person when do we do it and uh, I've heard that it's very random so I gotta figure out a way to give my gift to the person I have for Secret Santa. Maybe I'll use someone else to give it to her. Maybe I'll try to secretly put it on her desk. I don't think I'm that skilled, because I would have to walk into her classroom. I just got cut off by the technology teacher coming in and reminding me that we still have a weird schedule today, right? I was like, yeah, the choir's coming here, yes. It was kind of awkward because I was literally talking to you as the door opened. I don't remember what I was talking about, but big donut, yummy. Today's a two hour late start. Usually we have an hour late start. And I said this last time we had two hour late start that that was like unusual. Well, actually, last time it was an hour late start and I was like, that's unusual. Actually, the hour late start is normal. Two hour late start is unusual. So right now we're having a two hour late start, which means that 
I don't know what time the kids get here, but I don't have my first specialist class. I don't have the fourth graders until 1120. It's only 920 right now. There's so much time this morning. And I get everyone for 30 minutes still, which is interesting. And I have an hour lunch. How does that work? I'm just looking at the schedule. I'm very confused. I'm gonna have to wrap my brain around this while I eat this donut. <laughs> okay, bye. This donut is so big, I'm struggling to finish it. I think I need to put it down for later. <laughs> Why am I still eating it? Just don't eat it anymore, Delinia. Hello there. I don't know what is happening to my neck. It looks like I'm like, I have like a rash or something. I don't know, it's been doing that all morning. <laughs> it doesn't itch or anything, it's just, I think it might be just, maybe I'm sweaty, I don't know. Um, I went, uh, it's my break, it's lunchtime, hello. <laughs> I went into the, uh, the uh, lounge, the teacher's lounge. Well, I guess I went to the office area. And uh, I went to my mailbox after I went to the bathroom before, you know, I have my lunch. And I found my secret Santa gift by my mailbox. Would you like to see what they gave me? Of course you would. So I opened it. The first thing I saw was a chocolate frog. There was also this chocolate. <laughs> then there was also this. It's a like a lip balm and lotion thing. And then I saw all these socks. There's Hedwig. There's Ron Weasley, there's Hermione, there's Dumbledore, and wait, oh no, Hagrid, wait, Dumbledore? Dumbledore, why does he have a gray beard? He's supposed to have white. There's Dobby, that doesn't even look like Dobby. And there's Harry Potter. <laughs> and there's also this little mystery ornament. And then the last thing I saw was this mug. <laughs> So my secret Santa did a fantastic job. Oh wait, and the thing that I'm propping my phone up on, it's like a one of those book ends, I think. I don't know. But yeah, my secret Santa went all out on the Harry Potter stuff. I, I super duper appreciate it. This is awesome. And they also told me who they were. Um, I don't know this person very well. I mean, I probably met this person. There's someone in the ILC classroom named Kelsey Richardson. But uh, yeah. I'll figure out who it is and say thank you to them. <laughs> That'd be kind of funny if I didn't know who they were. I mean, it is funny. It'd be really bad if I didn't say thank you. Like, they're in my classroom with, with ILC, and I'm just all like, Oh, you're Kelsey, like, after, like, the whole class period? I didn't know. That would be weird. I need to figure out who that person is. And I'm making noise with tissue paper, because why not? Why not while I'm recording and, you know, just gonna make the sound even worse? Okay. I'm gonna go have lunch now and uh, maybe drop my secret Santa gift off at the person's mailbox too. I gotta figure out where the person's mailbox is. I don't know if they're like on the top or the bottom and it doesn't really make sense to put their package over there if it's, you know, I don't know. I'll figure it out. Bye. I opened the mystery ornament. It's Dumbledore. <laughs> Look at this guy's little face. He looks so happy. Look at his little smile. <laughs> it's so funny looking. I mean, that's the cutest Dumbledore I've ever seen. Hi! <laughs> I, I'm not ready to talk. Um, <laughs> hi! I'm getting home to, uh, uh, well, hi, I'm going home. Wow, I don't know what I'm saying. There's so many thoughts on my brain that I want to mention and I don't want to take up that much time, but I just took up like 15 seconds trying to start this. I am going home. It is 4.25. I'm going home at five o'clock. There's an after school like theater program that's been going on for 10 weeks and they have their show tonight and some of my favorite students are in it. So I'm going to watch their online show. They're going to live zoom their show today. They're in my classroom right now. So that's going to be fun to watch my classroom from my house. Um, but, uh, yeah, so I'm going to get home to watch that. And, uh, I also need to sing something on Smeal tonight, but I might do it tomorrow, but I might do it tonight. It really just depends on what Jacob's doing when I get home and if it works out with both of us. I need to sing it though. I need to sing a couple things on Smule and I've been waiting cause like when I get home from work, usually my voice is really tired. Like today I was singing Jingle Bells over and over again. So I'm like 
tired. <laughs> um, but I know I need to do it. I have to do it by Saturday. I want to get it done as early as possible, and I told them I was going to do today or tomorrow. I don't know if I'm going to do today, I, but I also don't want to just wait, make it for tomorrow. I don't know, you know, like, I, uh, sometimes doing Smule stuff isn't as fun as it used to be. It's just like a chore. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going home now. My hardest first graders weren't too bad today. Well, they were at the beginning. And then I said, you know what? I'm not going to do this again. If you're not sitting on your spot, I'm calling the office. And they said, no, thank you like the two girls that I was talking about last time. They're like, no, thank you. And I was like, that's not an answer on your spot or I'm calling the office. They didn't listen. I called the office and they were like, no. And I was like, I'm, I didn't, well, I didn't say anything. They're like, no. And I just walked quietly over, called the office. As soon as I called the office, they all started listening. They were all in their spots. They were all listening. And I was like, how come when I call the office, you listen, you should listen before I call the office. And so anyways, one person from the office came in, class went, I got to do the snowflake dance with them and we got to play jingle bells, which was fun because they've never played instruments in music class before. Or if they have, it was a long time ago because they just don't do anything in that class. They don't pay attention. They're always talking, they're always moving. Anyways, it was fun to actually teach those kids. I see them all the time. I don't look forward to seeing them. So if they just finally listen, maybe I'll look forward to seeing them because they're great individuals. They just have problems when they're all together. Anyway, so it went pretty well. My hardest kindergarten class is, at this, is on the same day as my hardest first grade class. And today, since the schedule was so weird because of the two hour late start, there's one kid in the kindergarten class who has a really hard time with change and adjusting and whatnot. And he gets really physically aggressive. So he pushed a kid really hard in the chest today, like full on pushed and knocked the wind out of their chest and they cried and I was like that is not okay I had to call the office I had to write a report so that kid was struggling a bit today but uh other than that all the classes were super small today like I had like max 15 kids in my classes today which was lovely and I think it's going to be like that for the rest of the week because parents start taking their kids you know away because I had a couple kids when I said that we we're having a party. I was like, all right, we'll have a party on Friday. They're like, I'm not going to be here Friday. And I was like, well, when you miss school, you miss out. Because <laughs> they're going to like Arizona or something to see family. A few of them are leaving to go see family early. So I'm like, that's fine. Less goodie bags for me to have to make and less kids for me to have to keep an eye on. <laughs> Anyways, today wasn't that bad. I'm going home and uh, I'll see you there. Hello, I'm home and... I'm waiting for the Zoom to open to watch the little show that's happening. It says, please wait. I am. What are you saying? Right now? I found my phone. Oh, okay. We got Taco Bell. Um, ah! Jacob tried to vlog a bit of it on his phone. I don't know if I had that clip in there or not. We might throw but... it up on screen right now. Yeah, if I have it, I'll throw it up on screen. If not, then yay, we got Taco Bell. Heyo! Heyo! Taco Tuesday! Taco Tuesday! Do you see catfish? I know you see snail off to the side, but do you see... Catfish? He's back there lurking! Hey buddy! What are you doing? Oh, hi Sebastian. Can I help you? He just like stepped onto my arm. He was like, what are you doing, mom? Back to catfish. Oh, you can see him. He's down there. Oop. <laughs> Sebastian, can I help you? He says, focus on me, mom, pet me. Goes back into the shadows. Guppies out here though, they like to flash their fins. Sebastian, no! That is not a string, that's a plant. Get down. <laughs> He's wild. Get down. We're watching The Last Matrix and eating Taco Bell. Woo woo! Movie night day three. Boop, boop. Okay, we should probably be quiet and watch it. Advent day 14. 
Another snowflake. I wonder how many more of these there are. 14. Who do we have here? Harry Potter in Muggle attire in uh, Dudley's old clothes, it looks like. Day 14. I like how he's going backwards. A sock! Master has given Dobby a sock! <laughs> Dobby is free! Oh, wait! Master has presented Dobby a sock! Let me get the actual socks out of this sock advent calendar for today, too! Because that's just hilarious, isn't it? Those are cute. Fun. Today is the. Octopada. Octopada. Maccabee. Maccabeo, Spain. Thank you.